Brian Cushing, the Texans star inside backer, shaking up on the play. So bad for Brian because he worked so hard and playing so well, lead tackler on our team. And, uh, you know, he's going to be missed. Well, I want to be around you know, I want to be here for the guys and, and help them best as I can, you know, whether it's um, you know, on spear or, or coaching tips or whatever. I mean, uh, I'm going to be here, you know, every single practice, every single day. And, uh, Yo, what up, YouTube? It's Superbox0909, and I finally got me the Xbox One. Yeah, it took me a while. Um, so, yeah, let's get into this uh, little scheme I got. Uh, stuff does work a lot differently from 360 to the Xbox One. I um, guess I didn't really know, but I mean, my stuff still works, but. You gotta you gotta mess with it a little bit. The zones and everything play a lot different. I'm still barely trying to get used to the game. Um, it's harder in my opinion, really harder. But let's get into the scheme uh, for the run play. You're gonna want these plays um, in your custom playbook, whatever. The scheme's out of a split flex, and you're gonna want to use a white shallow cross. You're gonna want to mix that play in with. Um, Hawks drive, and you want you definitely want to use the FL screen, and you definitely want to mix in the halfback slip screen too. So you got two screens on two sides of the ball. And I like running the power O, and I like running the where is it at? The halfback blast. All right, well, let's get into the scheme, all right? Let's flip flex. First play I'm going to go with, go over with is just the running plays. They're pretty self-explanatory. A patch, HP blast. What I like to do is I like to pass protect down, pinch a line. And if I see a lane, I'm, if I see a lane, damn it. Okay, if I see a lane in the middle, I'm going to run around the middle. Didn't get nothing there. There we go. If I see a lane in the middle, I'm going to run up the middle. If they're crowding the middle, I want to kick it out and run it like a little sweep. Alright. Now, go over the FL screen. What I like to do is I like to put Foster on a swing right to the right side of the screen. Put Hopkins on a drag route. And I want to pass protect slide left okay now you want to watch Johnson's route because Johnson's route will get open if they leave if if that guy plays off on the ball like that it's gonna get open he he dropped the ball but run it again FL screen okay put him on a little swing route to the outside okay put him on a, on a drag all right watch that little swing route there and see what I mean it'll get open all right Let's run the let's run the play 
on the FL screen the way it's supposed to be. Never want to throw that route. If they're pressed up like this, run the screen. Don't ever throw that route. There we go. There's your blockers out in front of you. There you go. FL screen. They start catching on to your FL screen. You want to switch it up a little bit. You want to, All you want to do is you want to put Foster on out route like this. Okay. Throw it to Foster right there. There's all your blockers. Touchdown. All right. Now, they start catching on to the FL screen. They're really playing heavily on the FL screen, FL screen. Then you want to hit them on the halfback slip screen. Okay. The way I like to run this play is I will put Foster and Daniels on out routes like this. I will put Johnson on a comeback route like that. I will pinch the line and I will throw it to the tight end. If he breaks that tackle, I, I have a whole bunch of blockers in front of me. So, yes, you gotta wait a little bit and then throw it to him, and don't run into your blockers. This game's really finicky. It's really hard compared to 360, but I can still do it. It's just I messed up on the play there. Okay, half back to the screen. Foster on out. Daniels on an out, Johnson on a comeback, pinch the line, wait a little while, then throw it to Daniels, and you can throw it to the halfback too. If you don't see anybody go over there like that, you could throw it to the halfback and just run the screen. But if you see somebody go towards the halfback, then you, you want to throw it to that tight end. Let's see if I can give you all a good example. Right there. Couldn't get the ball off. Damn it. This block shedding on this game is ridiculous. Not gonna lie, I missed the 360. The block shedding on here is ridiculous. I mean, you don't get no time to throw the ball. They're already in your face. Nobody guard the screen. I threw the screen. Just take your yards. Okay, that's the screen pass. Alright. Let's go over the plays. Okay, the play I like to use is white shallow cross. And no matter what, my two reads are going to be Foster, Johnson. Very rare, well, Daniels. Daniels is going to be my first read. If Daniels breaks the outside and nobody follows him, like nobody goes towards him on the flats, I'm going to throw it to him for a quick, quick yardage. Just like that. Daniels is going to be my first read. Alright. See if I can give you a good example. Throw it to the halfback. You got blockers out in front. And just follow your blocks up. Upfield. If you get time to throw. I just got picked off. If you get time to throw to Johnson, you'll see him that. Streak should take all the zones away. So, that's just going to give you a quick little yardage right there. Uh, that play, I don't run it um, a lot. Like I said, though, you need to read if anybody's following Daniels or not. See, no one was following Daniels. Just pick up your quick yardage. Alright, so that's that play. Um, it's usually just a quick hitter to the halfback. Or the or the tight end. Now this play is pretty good for me. It's called Hawks Drive. Now Hawks Drive, I like to put Johnson on a slant route like this to the right side of the screen, and I like to put Daniels on a flare route like this. All right, that's the only two adjustments I like making to this play. They were blitzing me. Anytime they're blitzing you, just get it, get the ball out. All right. Blitzing me again, just get the ball away. I'm trying to give you a good example of what I want to throw to. Okay. All right, there it is. That right there. That's what you want. 
you want to hit Johnson on that slant route. Now this is a pretty good money play that I found that does the job. And you can mix it in with the, the other play because it looks exactly the same. You can throw that drag route too. Just don't throw that drag route if you're in a long yardage situation. That is only for short, short yardage. Okay, but you want to watch the field, watch the field. You could even throw it right there. And you have a lot of blockers out in front of you. So, you know, hit the halfback right over the middle and make your reads. All right, run it again. You're blitzing me. Get it out. All right. Make your adjustments. All right, they're guarding him, they're guarding him, and I shouldn't have done that. That's, that's a bad example right there. All right, that's that play right there. Another play I like to run is PA Ravens Fork. And what I like to do is like Smart Route Martin, Smart Route Hopkins, Smart Route Johnson, and put Daniels on a out like this. No one's guarding him. I hit him right there. Just get your yardage. If you have time, though, you can hit that. The post route you can hit, but I mean, I threaded that one in there. I really like hitting that dig route when it, when once he breaks right there. I really like hitting that dig route a lot. So there's another. There's another thing you can throw too. It's a pretty good money play right here. I mean, you got a lot of good reads on this on this play. Couldn't get that digger out. I wanted to get it, but I couldn't get it. Look, no one's guarding them. Just take your yardage, and that's it. They're they're gonna guard that. They're gonna guard Martin up top. And that's whenever you want to hit Daniels on the bottom. Right in there, if they're going towards Daniels, of course you want to go to Martin. Alright, there's that play. Um, another play I like running is this halfback circle. And on the halfback circle, I like putting Martin on and out and putting Daniels on and out. And I like streaking Johnson, just like this. But this is like a levels kind of play. You get your levels on the field, you read the levels. Okay? Read the levels, read the levels, bam. That's a really safe play to run because, like I said, you have your levels on the field. Read the levels. Again, they didn't guard Daniels. Read the levels. If you have time, you can throw to the halfback. If you have time, because I mean, it that angle route takes a long time to develop on this game. Same thing. Get Johnson up top. And if they're heavy blitzing, you can do that. Read your levels. That's all you gotta do. Is read your levels. See how I just read the level? I mean, that's 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 that's. that's his, Right, that's just basic football right there when you run levels. Look, you got your level right there. Pick up whatever, five yards, whatever you can pick up. I mean, so all you gotta do is read your levels. Look, had him up top. But well, you got those three options to throw to on that play, so that's a really good, safe play to use. Just make your reads. Alright, last play that I want to show y'all is Hawks Quick Out. And these plays you're going to have to go inside custom playbook and make your own custom playbook and put these plays in there because they're not going to be in the regular, regular playbook. Okay, what I like to do is I like to put Johnson. I messed up the play. Yeah. Alright, I'm sure you'll play now. I can put Johnson on the slant in, I like to smart route Martin, and I like to put Daniels on the flare like this.
Okay. See how you also have all that auto motion? And I like throwing that little slant right there. And if he's open, throw that slant because they're they can't guard Martin and they can't guard Johnson all at once. And if someone's user guarding that, then you're probably gonna get Daniels wide open. So You can also streak Martin, and that'll give you a little bit more space to throw to on that slant route. So they start catching on what you're doing, you want to you want to streak Martin. Look that out wide open. You never want to forget about that out. So look at that, slant in for Daniel on a flare. All right. Couldn't make the throw. I was trying to throw to Daniel. All right, one more time with this FO screen. This is one of my key plays on this on this scheme. You've got to run the FO screen. You've got to run it. See how he's pressed up to the line like that, though. You don't want to run the, the FO screen whenever he's pressed up to the line like that. So no matter what, you're going to the FO screen. And if they're guarding it, you have that drag mount, that drag route over the middle too. Like I said again, FL screen, they start picking up on your tendencies. You want to put Foster on an out route just like this. Look at all that blocks you have in front of you. I just, I run into my blockers a lot on this game, so I, gotta get, I really got to get used to this game. Also, like I told you, we have Johnson out there too. If they play off coverage, Johnson is going to be wide open. All right, well, that concludes the scheme. And um, this scheme is called uh, Houston's Light em Up Offensive Scheme. And hope y'all could light up that scoreboard up there. Um, just make your reads, and you should have no, no trouble. Uh, it's a pretty good scheme to run. Um, try to come out with something better. I'm trying to come out with another strong close scheme. Uh, a, lot of, a lot of stuff kind of works differently. So I'm trying to come back out with my uh, five star mini scheme, but for the Xbox One. And I already know it's Madden, the new Madden's about to come out, so I'm not really trying to rush anything, you know, because I'm going to have to be making new schemes for the, for the next Madden. So, all right. Well, I hope you all enjoyed the video, guys. Go out there and use it. Like, comment, and subscribe if you liked it. And it's your boy, Superbox. I'm signing out. Peace.